<laughs> man. This album, like J freaking Cole. I have to say, this is, I was impressed. This is good. Mm, 12 tracks. He had um, this one song, man. You're starting off with 95 South. I think that was a great introduction song. And named the album The Off Season. And this was an inspiration. A film, actually, he joined an uh, African basketball league in Rwanda. It was the Rwanda Patriots. And as you guys know, our little background story of J. Cole, he was a, a great basketball player, you know, and I know he went to college and, you know, majority of his raps and his rhymes, he talked about his college life, um, how it was. And, you know, sometimes he didn't even know what he wanted to do in life. And what he did, he just, you know, got some inspiration. And, you know, from Tupac, when Brenda had a baby, he always like was enjoying music and he was decided like, you know, I'm just going to, you know, be a musician. And um, he, he, he utilized everything he needed. He made uh, connections and, you know, with Dreamville, all this type of stuff, man. And he started making these crazy songs, man, to the point like it was very lyrical, spiritual. And, you know, he, he was cool. Like he, even though he was like a nerd, but he was like real cool, like to be around, like he was himself. And he actually preaches that. So a lot of his songs is, is very positive, man. Like I, I love J. Cole. Um, when I was growing up, I didn't really mess with him like that. I was like, oh, J. Cole, you know, people in my school was just talking about him in high school. But when I actually gave a, uh, a shot, and uh, I would never forget, you know, listening to Born Center, um, <laughs> listening to Lights, Please, Lights, Please, Turn Off the Lights. I was like, oh, Cold World. I was like, okay, this dude got some nice, catchy songs, man. And, um, you know, he, he's he's very talented, you know, uh, representing out of Fayetteville. Uh, I, I have to say, in, in NC, I was just like, wow. Like this is this is really good, man. And so, what I liked about him, he's very transparent. Um, when we got to uh, one of my favorite tracks was "My Life," and I have to say, when Moray when he was uh, singing that hook, bro, oh my god, the melodies fit so perfectly. Twenty One Savage, he did his thing. Uh, it was good, man. Talking about his life, his life, and you know, people he losing his friends in the coffin and stuff like that, man. It's just ridiculous, man. And so, I mean, let's he can really talk about a lot of things that people relate to. And that's why I respect J. Cole as an artist. I mean, he takes his art so seriously. You think about, uh, it was one song, Applying Pressure. Love the beats on that, man. Um, really great, really great song. Uh, it was another song, I think, Hunger and Hillside. That was good. That was one of the last songs on the track. I think I forget somebody else, but for the most part, I was, I was thoroughly impressed, man, by just everything what he was doing man you know i mean this is something for like you know inspiration from the athletes um both professional and amateur you know as you can see you know they're going in between seasons and sharpening their tools in the off season so as you can see it's like man i'm getting ready like you know this is something you can bump in the gym so far because i listened to it uh like two or three times so and then i had to say man this is um a really good piece of work here i for a minute i thought you didn't have any, any features but i was like okay he had features he had bass in here it's not south so uh j cole did really a great thing with this man uh, i'm really looking forward to his next project uh, with another collab with dreamville you know uh, i think that was <laughs> that was really good i think back in 2019 uh <laughs> we had down bad and all these other songs on there i was like oh shoot you know uh but and sacrifices but yeah man i have to give my respects to j cole hope he wins an award for here um this is something positive talked about like 2021 2020 uh people recovering from um, the covid and stuff like that man and getting back into things and back into the rhythm but it's all about shopping your tools man and he's just saying you know just being transparent being yourself and look at him now you know very successful artist so um thank you for dropping this album onto the world and i have to say yeah i like it i give it uh, 8 out of 10 so far. This your boy Young Link. You guys tune in, like, comment, subscribe, share this video. I'm out. Deuces.